Hello everyone, my name is Heather Moorfield Lang and this is my YouTube channel Tech15 and today I'm going to be telling you about a fun new tool called Vizia. Vizia allows you to embed questions, polls, and more into your videos, which allows you to engage your students or in professional development, however you would like to use it. So while your students or your peers are watching videos, you can ask them questions while they are watching videos in a flipped classroom format. Or if you would like your teachers or peer educators or librarians, which is my field, if you would like them to watch a video before you have a workshop, you can actually have engagement in your videos while folks are watching them and you can have an interactive video experience. So let me show you how this works. This is Vizio.co. You can see up here in the upper left hand corner the address for the site. If you go over to the right side where it says log in, you click and log in. You can log in with Google or you can create your own email password combination. I've already done that so I'm going to log in. And then from there, it's very simple. They currently support videos from YouTube and Wistia. Now, as we know, YouTube has all different videos from all over. So if there's something you want from TED or TED Ed or TeacherTube, Go Noodle, or wherever you might have a favorite video from, Vimeo, whatever the case may be, typically this would be used in a more educational format. You can choose where your videos come from. But at this time, they do support videos from those locations. I've already chosen one of my very favorite which is dance versus PowerPoint. Great presentation. I highly recommend watching it sometime when you when you have the chance. So I'm going to go down to share. I'm going to copy and paste, grab the link, and then I'm going to come over here to Visio, put in the link, and then I will click continue. And then I have my video and then I'm ready to go. At this point, the way it will work, and I'm going to do this pretty quickly, I click play and I go through and at this point, as I, and I can speed up the video, I can do whatever I wish. As the video is playing, I can go through at points, I could watch the video, I'm gonna speed this up a little bit like a cooking show, and I can stop the video wherever I would like, I can stop it, and then I can click on quiz, poll, response, or call to action. And if I would like there to be a response or a question, or whatever the case may be, I can actually type in a question or response. How would you, present in a different manner or whatever I might like to ask. I can ask anything that I want and then I click save and now you see here in the lower corner on the left hand I have a now response that my students or viewers or my folks who are watching this particular video would now respond to. I now have interaction with this video. And I could go further, I could click again, and at this point maybe I have a quiz. So I could do a multiple choice question if I wish. And then I can save that one if I wish, and you'll notice it's down there as well. And then I can save that, and I am done. And I can continue on, and then let me click one more time just to show you, and then I can do a poll, or, and then I can save that, I'm just kind of adding this in at the moment, and then I can also do a response. I can do all types of things. When I am done, I'm going to stop this. When I'm finished with the video, we're just going to pause it for a moment. I have the options to preview. I can share it. This is the link of this particular video. You will notice now the video is being shared via Vizia because at this point we have made the video available interactively with Vizia. I also recommend, because this came from TED Ed or YouTube, you can also share the original link if you want to make sure that you are including and taking care of issues for copyright. You have the option to embed this if you have Blackboard, if you have Classroom Collaborate or Edmodo or are using a classroom performance system, you have the option to embed this into your classroom systems. You can also download all of your responses or you can also put this in Google Sheets. And then you can also have uh, the setting turned on where the viewers will be asked to provide their name and email at the beginning of the video. And then you can also delete if you're unhappy with what you've done. And everything is kept in your videos. You can invite folks to join you. And you have all of these options completely free available for you here in this interactive video option 
for classes, flipped classes, anything that you would like to be able to use where you are looking to have an interactive video option for your students, peers, professional development, whatever might interest you. So this is Vizia, pretty cool. I've been um, looking into using it and working with it for my online classes because I teach 100% online. So I really like the interaction of this because I record lots of videos, I use lots of videos, and this is a really nice tool to be able to use for that type of interaction with the materials that I load in my classes, also create for my classes. So I hope you like this, enjoy, hope it's something new for you to use, and I appreciate your time. We'll have new content soon here on Tech 15. Thanks so much.